Hi, today we are going to learn about using induction. Let's look at a problem. Solve how many pieces are in the next figure. Now induction means that we derive a certain result for n is equal to 1, n is equal to 2. Then we certain it for n is equal to k like that. So in the first figure we have one triangle. In the second figure, suppose this is 90 degree, we have two right triangles. One will be this one and one will be this one. In the third figure, we have three. In the fourth figure, we have four. So we can say for n is equal to one, we have one right triangle. n is equal to two, we have two right triangles. So for n is equal to k, we should have k right triangles. So for n is equal to 5, I should have 5 right triangles. So C5 is the answer. Next problem. Solve. Each circle is equally divided. What is the angle of one arc of the next figure? Now in the first figure, there are two arcs. So complete angle is 360 degrees. 360 divided by 2 gives us 180 degrees. Now, in the second figure, there are three segments or three arcs, we can say. So, 360 divided by 3, 120 degrees. For 360 by 4, that's 90. So, for n is equal to 1, it is 360 by n plus 1. Sorry, 360 by 2, we can say. I'll generalize it later. For n is equal to 2, it is 360 by 3. For n is equal to 3, n being the number of figure. First figure, second figure, third figure. I have 360 by 4. So for n is equal to k, the pieces will be 360 by k plus 1. Sorry, the angle will be 360 by k plus 1. So I need to find the for the next figure. So this is fourth figure. So I need to determine for the fifth figure. So n is equal to 5. The angle would be 360 over 5 plus 1. That's 360 by 6. Which will be 60 degrees. So A60 is the answer. Next problem. Solve into how many pieces is the square divided in the next figure. First figure, one piece. Second figure, two pieces. Third figure, one, two, three, three pieces. So n is equal to one, one piece. n is equal to two, two piece. n is equal to three, three piece. So I can say for n is equal to k, I'll have k pieces. I need to know for the fifth figure here. This is fourth, fifth. So for n is equal to 5, I'll have 5 pieces. So B5 is the answer. I hope you can practice more problems on using induction now. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.